<coughs> hey guys, Chris's Toy Tube here. Tonight I am bringing you my Cabbage Patch Kid phone. I always wanted one as a kid, but I never got one. My husband actually got this for me from a friend of his that dealt in antiques and collectibles. Um, she did come with the original cord. However, the little clippy thing that goes in here, that broke. The one that goes in the back here, that broke as well. So we just end up ended up tossing it. Um, this is from 1984. It is made by Coleco. She's got some wear on the back here, but I mean, you know, really, what do you expect for something this old? I'm thinking that eventually I'll probably touch it up if I can without losing the integrity and originality of it. But I just think she's adorable with her blue eyes. And you can see the detailing on her hair. Yeah, she's a bit dirty. We've tried to clean her up. Um, I was afraid I would chip the paint if we scrubbed too hard. So if anybody has any suggestions on maybe how we can clean her up without hurting her, that would be great. Last I knew she did work, but that was probably about five years ago when we first got her. Um, I was afraid to continue using her because I did not want to break it, so it might or might not work. And um, what else can I tell you about this? It does have the switch on the back here where you can turn the ringer off and on. Which I thought that was kind of neat because I honestly don't remember back then the phones having a ringer off and on switch. But you can see there it says Coleco on the receiver here. And, um, oh, I just beamed her. Let's see. It has a serial number on it. I don't know if that means anything or not. But it is a five-digit serial number. <coughs> I'm not sure if these came numbered editions, like special, limited, or what. I do remember only a friend or two had these as I was a child. But anyway, this is the, my Cabbage Patch phone. I hope you enjoyed watching. Please leave a like, subscribe, uh, share with your friends. Don't forget about our Facebook page either. It's Chris's Toy Tube on Facebook. Share that with your friends. Leave likes there. That's probably the best way to stay up to date with what's going on here. And that's all for now. Chris's Toy Tube out. Good. Bye. See ya.